is very high. It's been an up and down season for well. He's thrown some poor games. And he's thrown some good ones. The last time he faced these guys, the Brewers, he, he was dealing. Gave up a couple of hits in the first inning and then nothing after that. It's sharply through for a base hit as Adamas singles in the right center, continues his hitting ways, and a one out base runner. He swings and skies one out to center, but right to Reynolds. Wait on it to come down and make the catch. And the inning ends. Three fly ball outs for Milwaukee. They get a hit, strand a man through a half inning. It's the Brewers nothing, and the Pirates coming on up. See Burns' numbers on the year. What really pops out is 115 strikeouts in 74 innings. That's pretty amazing to go with 14 base on balls. And right off the end of the bat, right to Wong. Two men are out. Uh, Hira just able to get a toe back on the bag. This one grounded sharply to second base. Colton Wong has it. Spins and throws from shallow right. Takes care of Reynolds. It's a 1-2-3 inning for Corbin Burns. Here's Jace Peterson who had such a great homestand. Peterson line drive right center field right on cue. He plugs the gap. That one's going to go all the way to the wall. Tyrone Taylor round 30 is going to score with ease. Peterson on his way to third. The throw there not in time. It's an RBI triple and the Brewers lead it one nothing. Jace Peterson again and again. And hits that one sharply right field line. That's down. To the wall it goes in to score Peterson. Jackie Bradley Jr. rolls into second with an RBI double. Yep, take advantage of those hangers. That was one there. Jackie really starting to come out of that funk here. Now the set. And the 2 2 coming. A swing and a miss. He struck him out, went back to the changeup. And that ends the inning. Brewers pick up a pair. Through an inning and a half, it's Milwaukee two and the Pirates nothing. And he has a base hit. Up the middle to start the second. Jacob Stallings has a single to center. Burns looking for that ground ball double play here. And that ball's launched. Center field deep, and it is going to be caught by Bradley. Stallings rounded second. The throw comes in. Here are the tag. He's out. Oh, Jackie Bradley Jr. totally baited him into that. <laughs> Acted as if it was gone. He had me fooled for a minute as well. He did. Boy, what a deep job that was. Kind of reminds you of Lorenzo Kane, doesn't it? Some a little bit. The 0 1. That's hit towards right. Playable for Tyrone Taylor. Couple of steps back. He's there, makes the catch, and that ends the inning. Well, Jackie Bradley Jr. He's got an RBI double in the game, and he took an extra base hit away from Gamble and picked off a runner, too. Big part of the reason why the Brewers currently enjoy a six game lead in the NL Central is the depth that they built over the offseason. Swing of the fly ball out toward right field. Gamble drifts to his right and makes a catch for the second out. Two gone and Jackie Bradley Jr. is coming up. There's a swing and a miss. Struck him out. And Crow strands the runner. Here's the 3 0 coming. And a swing and a ball fought off. Hit to left. And it'll drop in. Three Brewers didn't seem to pick it up. Yelich wasn't coming on from left. And it fell just behind the outfield or into the outfield dirt. Grass, excuse me, from a. Thomas and Robertson short and third. The 0 2 pitch, and that is a call third strike. There's that first strikeout for Corbin Burns. Reynolds didn't like the pitch. Two and two, and swing and a miss. Struck him out with a big curveball, and it's back to back strikeouts for Burns to get himself through the bottom of the fourth. And Robertson back up the middle of base hit. There you go, hanging slider. Stayed on it, hit it hard into center. Good to bat by Robinson. Comebacker Crow going to throw to second and get the force there. Robertson forced one to four. Adamas reaches first on the fielder's choice. There are two outs. Here's the pitch from him. And a swing and a ground ball out towards short right. The second baseman, Frazier, charges, plants, throws, and gets the out. One pitch later, the inning comes to an end. Burns working on Gamble. 0 for his last 11. 2-1. Hit high and deep out to right center field. No question that that's a home run. He lined it right out of the ballpark. You can tell right off the bat. Ben Gamble with the home run. And the Pirates are on the board. It's two to one.
Two and two on Tom. Burns throws and a swing and a miss. Struck him out on a high fastball. Strikeout number three for Corbin Burns. One of the best backdrops in baseball. Pitch to Newman. Popped up. Right near the mound. Burns saying he's got it. Keston here says, get out of there. So Burns gets out of Dodge. Hira makes the catch, and the inning is over. Keston Hira at the plate with two men on base. He is hit with guys on base all night long. Hira bouncing ball through. Base hit. In the score is Taylor. And Keston Hira with an RBI single. It is three to 3-1 Brewers. They immediately get the run back. Top of the six. 2-2 two -two pitch. Robertson in the air. Shallow center. Catch is made. Here comes Peterson, and he's in. Sacrifice fly at an RBI for Daniel Robertson. It's 4-1. to Corbin Burns back out there. A 4-1 lead for the Brewers. Bottom of the seventh. He has struck out just three in his outing here tonight. The pitch. And that's a called third strike. And Reynolds knew it. Four strikeouts now for Corbin Burns. The one-two pitch. And that is a called third strike. Two punch outs here in the seventh for Burns. Both looking. Gamble turning around and asking Fairchild a question. Crowd getting loud here at PNC Park. 3-2 pitch. Ground ball. Right to Hira. He gets it on a big hop. Wins the foot race to first. And ends the Pirates threat. Here in the bottom of the seventh. We go to the bottom of the eighth inning. Burns going back out there against the bottom of the order. 2-2. Two -two. Hit off the end of the bat to short. Willie Adamas has it. Throws to first in time to get Newman. One away. A career high in innings pitched. Or what is up here with Corbin Burns? Wouldn't this be something else? There's no way he would stay in if he's got any kind of an issue going. Williams has been throwing in the bullpen. so They're going to take the baseball from him. Man, is that disappointing. They're on the corners now for the Brewers. One, two pitch. Ooh, that ball is hit well. Narvaez sends it deep to right. It is down. Base of the wall. In to score Robertson. Yelich to third. And the Brewers add to their lead. It is 5-1. Swing, line drive, base hit to right. That's going to score at least Yelich. Narvaez is going to be sent around third. Here comes the throw home. It's cut off. Two runs, single. Tyrone Taylor. 7 to 1 Brewers. And Brian Reynolds, who's 0 for 3 today with a couple of strikeouts, has a 14 game hitting streak on the line. Toward left near the foul pole. <laughs> on the foul ball. I think Bartner got that, didn't he? Huh. Ball was caught. Huh? Did, 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 did he catch it? Yeah. No way this kid caught this ball. No way. Yeah, oh yeah. my gosh. Well, I said Bartner that caught is that ball. awesome. That's unbelievable. That's that kid's like eight years younger than Bartman. Yeah. Look at oh, this. Look. Oh, he gave uh, him a high five. Yeah. <laughs>